Singing could be a mystery for many of you. The human voice is spontaneous and is the instrument that we use to express our emotions. And perhaps you haven't realized yet, but the singing voice is present in every single moment of our life. How about when you find a cute puppy on the park? Probably you will say, oh, what a cute and sweet puppy. This is high pitch. Or when you are trying to express your frustration, you will say probably, oh, I can't believe I dropped my phone in the toilet again, <laughs> right? This is lower pitch. So ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you that life is a pitch. <laughs> Tonight, I want to talk about the incredible gift of singing, of how singing has opened several doors for me and has shaped the person I am today. Singing is a powerful tool. Just look to songbirds. When a male songbird sings to a female songbird with reproductive purposes, it activates the pleasure center of the male's brain. And in humans, it has similar effects. When you sing, your body releases endorphins, a hormone that is associated with the feeling of pleasure, and oxytocin, a hormone that helps to alleviate levels of stress and anxiety. But why and how this happened? Could you just start to build out a song and start to feel happy immediately? Well, this is possible, and especially if you love the song. You can have even all these benefits just by singing in the shower. And it gets better if you add proper breathing technique during that shower solo. Because if you haven't realized it, singing is an exercise that requires proper breathing technique and has similar effects as a workout. Singers are athletes, athletes of the voice, athletes of the vocal folds, and the vocal folds are a muscle that needs to be trained if you want to become a professional performer, a singer, a speaker, or even for all of you, is necessary. Singing is also an aerobic activity. Sometimes when I finish to sing an aria from an opera, an aria is a song that is singing in the opera, I feel it's sounded. I feel that I have run like three miles. And it's because it's an aerobic activity. Uh, when you sing, um, you bring more oxygen into the blood, and the, this improves circulation. And this is going to help you to have a better mood. This is all possible because singing is based in breathing. And by taking deep and lower breath, you had immediately an excellent anxiety reduced tool. Let me give you an example. I would like that you practice with me a breathing exercise that I used to calm down myself before a performance and increase my lung capacity. Actually, I did this before coming on the stage. So I would like that you put your pants, pounds over your knees, take a long and deep and lower breath, inhale, and release this air, thinking that the energy is moving from your toes, it goes to your knees, then travel to your hips, then your chest, then your neck, and it's going out from your forehead. This energy that is going out is all the anxiety is all your problems that you're thinking about. Repeat this as many times as you want. This is going to help to lower your heart beat, which is, and is also going to help you to get relaxed. Thanks to the breathing, singing has become like some sort of med meditation for me. It gives me the calm, the focus, the consciousness, 
and the energy to perform. But most important, I feel that the vessel of expression is open. My emotions can travel from you, from me to you and back. Singing is an exciting and deep experience. Let me give you an example. Escucharemos mudos latir nuestras arterias y sollozar los árboles desnudos. Un día, cualquier día, breve y eterno, el amor es el mismo en otoño, en verano y en invierno. Everyone has seen at some point in their life. I assure you that some of you have had the best time of your life singing in a karaoke with a group of friends. <laughs> or maybe singing in your cars, singing in the shower, singing everywhere, or even singing in a club, dancing and party the whole night. Singing is so freeing and is so powerful that promotes self-esteem, confidence, bonding, brings people together and enables you to meet more people. I bet that you have songs that made you think of the happiest moments of your life. And they made you feel so happy that you can build them out at the top of your lands. But I'm sure that you also had songs that remembers you of the saddest point of your life. And other songs that help you during the process of healing and recover from difficult situations. So we can say that singing is a healing instrument. Singing works as a medicine prescription and is cheaper than any other medicine. <laughs> so singing is a medicine prescription because it releases serotonin. And serotonin is considered one of the hormones of happiness. And it can help you to alleviate the feeling of loneliness and depression. Actually, scientists have proof that singers have the lowered levels of cortisol. Cortisol is the hormone that generates stress and depression. And perhaps that is one of the reasons I feel so happy with the life I choose for myself. Nothing has been or will be too much in order to achieve my dreams because I attain my own happiness by singing. I'm so grateful with the Fulbright program that has helped me through this journey of discovering the unlimited possibilities of my voice. I just want to make clear that before becoming a Fulbrighter, I was already a singer, but a singer that couldn't learn more about technique and style in my own country. I feel that I have improved 10 years of studying voice technique in just one year of doing my master's degree. And all of this is thanks to the Fulbright Scholarship. Singing allows you to express all the things that you can find the words to say. I communicate better through my singing. Let sing becomes part of your life. Sing in the shower, sing in your car, sing everywhere. Because singing is a gift that we give to ourselves and to others. And tonight, I'm honored to share that gift to all of you. I'm going to perform Baquianas Brasileiras, number five, by the Brazilian composer Hector Villalobos. This song is about the beauty of the eventide and how the gorgeous moon is able to embellish the heaven, the night, and even make silent the birds just with its richness and light. <laughs> 